wherever you may be, to another Walkabout Wednesday. We're here on 113 West Church Street in uh, downtown Weatherford. It is Walkabout Wednesday, and well, we are uh, just feeling all the February feels, and what better place to usher in this uh, sweetest of seasons than our very own Sweet Amelia's. So let's take a Walkabout. They're all decorated for the Valentine season. Behind me, but always at least three steps ahead of me, of course, we have Kristen. Welcome, Kristen. Hi, gang. Thanks, Tim. Today, Kristen is here with Nancy. And Renee. Hi, Nancy. Hi, Renee. Hello. Hello. Our, our spokespeople for Sweet Amelia's, I think. Uh, I'm not afraid. Nancy's going to go first. I'm Kristen. Thanks, guys. Thanks for coming to Sweet Amelia's today to join us. We also have some wonderful guests here, some sweet moms with their kids. We're so excited. They just walked in, and so I was like, this is perfect. You get an opportunity to see what we're all about with people inside. So the owners, Robert and Emily Cooper, um, had a vision of wanting to create a community. We have Sweet Amelia's. We also have Ironworks Coffee. Both wonderful places, two different ideas. This was really family oriented, a little bit happy, 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 really fun for the families and the kids. Um, the purpose for the Sweet Amelia's was making the world a sweeter place, one tasteful experience at a time. And I think we've got that. We've got a lot of different products and things that we can do. Our popcorn can be done for all occasions, whether it's weddings or birthday parties or team sports. You have something coming up, Super Bowl's coming up, popcorn's a great thing for that. So just anything you can imagine for any event, we can do any colors. Um, special orders, we love those. And uh, speaking of special orders on our products, I'm gonna hand you off to Renee, which knows all things we know. Hello. flavor then we have all all of this we have salt and vinegar smoked cheddar a uh, honey mustard is very popular dill people love dill uh, the cracker jacks Chicago is very popular now what's the, Chicago Chicago is caramel and cheddar and, and it's called Chicago a little sweet savory that's where they sell it in Chicago mm -hmm. yes so that is very Perfect. popular Perfect. Yes, I mean, I it, know it, all today. it is delish, delicious. Caramel is a big seller. Probably our one. It, 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 yes. yes. I'm just uh, of course, right now, our main focus is our and that is our vanilla popcorn, which is we make all all during the year, whatever season it is, and then this has pink chocolate. Drizzle on it. Mm -hmm. Delicious. <laughs> Delicious. Trust me, I've tried it all. Now, I don't know if Nancy did enough justice for Renee. So, Renee has been here for three owners now? Yes. With the same, it's always been a popcorn base. Yes. 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 And I've made it all. Gelato in this case. 
Now tell us about gelato. Tell us what, what makes gelato different from ice cream. Uh, I'm sure that's a tough question. Well, Nancy has a really good idea. <laughs> <laughs> I personally it's some really much better. It is. The, 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 the science behind it. <laughs> it is the fact that with ice creams, you get the ice crystals. Sure. That's the yeah. word ice. With gelato, it is frozen it's, at a much denser rate, so it's going to make it creamier and mm -hmm. oh so delicious. Yes. It's, 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 it's no arguments here. And <laughs> if it's a sorbet, yes. it's made with water and not milk. Making it dairy free. Yes. So people can come in and get their dairy free. Like vegan people? Yes. It's delicious, and that is actually my favorite. The lemon and the they're so nice. I love that. It's kind of like a lemon chill. Yeah, I love the lemon chill. Yes, yes, I love it. So, then we have the cotton candy. Multiple flavors. Multiple flavors. These go on for, I mean, they're going to keep them on. Now, you guys had this, had like peach for peach festival yes. season, yes. correct? Yes, yes. yes. we did. Yeah. One of our most popular ones is dill. Go figure. Okay. And the dill bomb. So have you had it? Is it? Does it have the sweet? Does it have? Or is it the sweet? No, it's not there. It's not there. It's not there. What do you like there? You don't want to eat it. So are you going to run your house? No. 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 Which to me is better than getting like the candy, the multiple yes. guess fudge. And it it's chocolate. Just because, like I said, it's my hair. Where do you go? Texas Heart. Who doesn't Heart Texas? Yeah. It's I delicious. said Texas Heart, and that wasn't right. So, it's the, the gelato. And then the gelato. Yeah. And then, of course, it's my hair. So, in the summer, always have more uh, because gelato is so much in the summer. And we always have full. Our men's straw is actually made with our, um, our mint base, but we have put in the Girl Scout Thin Mints. Yes. Now, how do you say that word? Straw You have to say it this. Straw oh, Tella. You, you got to move the hands. You got to move and, the hands. Yeah. Gotcha. Mm -hmm. And we have the special chocolate-covered strawberry just for Valentine's chocolate-covered yes. strawberries. You've got three different sizes yes. in addition to the float. Yes. yes. So that was what I was going to mention is our affogato. Yes. So with that, we talked about the doubles. You can do a float with any of these. You can also do a, so a coffee. And then we have espresso here in a coffee float. Or if you want... Yeah, it's good for my younger flavor. Maybe the coffee is good to the coffee. And then walk across the street to Ironworks and get a shot of espresso with a nodded there. Genius. Genius. An affogato. An affogato, right? Yes. And then we have our pretzel rods right there. Yes. Pretzel rods also bedecked for, for uh, Valentine's. Yes, over pretzels. Yes. Very good. Those are delish. Come around here. Tell us about these baskets. Okay. This is my big one. This is Renee's baby. This is what she thinks. Small is $8 for the basket and the wrap and the bucks. Whatever you want to put in here, then you add to it. So whatever you want to put in. Um, the large is $10. And like I said, I just put all kinds of stuff in here. Like I add little things. But you can... Well, you can, you can, you can, you can, you can 
So that brings us to, I'm going to steal your microphone. That brings us to the Walkabout Wednesday winner. Well, last week, anyways. Let's, let's back up a bit here so we can see Tim. There he is. Don't know him. Tim, tell us what you Well, we had a winner last week. Randy, congratulations for walking into uh, Market and Company and claiming the gift card at Market and Company. And I am very excited to offer uh, this week's Walkabout Wednesday prize, which is a basket from here at Sweet Amelia's. To win, you just need to be the first person to come on over and mention the Walkabout Wednesday winners. Put your name right here on our board. Pose for a picture with the board, and uh, you will have claimed the prize. I'm particularly excited about this one. I am too. It looks like it's got what it's we got just, here? Fudge and popcorn. This one, this particular one was just made. Smarties. Oh, yes. Smarties. Yes. Smarties for that smart Alex sweetheart in your life, right? Yes. <laughs> just made and ready for the yes. Valentine's just holiday. Ready for Valentine's. Yes. Okay. Wow. One of you saying yes, one saying no. <laughs> Nancy. And wrapping up, just a couple of things that I want to mention. We also have gift cards at Sweet Amelia's, and you can put any denomination on an app that you would like. Some people will actually make these, add it to a basket so that whatever they get, the good part they get, they can then come back and have that for you. Um, a couple of other things I like to do is we do events. We do those off-site as well as on-site. A lot of times where you'll see us over at Heritage Park and our garden room. So the city has been absolutely wonderful to work with and with getting those events going for us as well. We didn't even pay for you to say that. We <laughs> did. Okay. Uh, we also have events here. I don't know if you may have seen our Disney Journey or not or Harry Potter or not. That's another event that we put on. You also can rent out this facility for birthday parties. Say a Saturday morning before we show up, you can rent it out. The, um, in addition to that, we do fundraisers. And fundraisers keeping it local. Schools. We have Hall Middle School in Tyson Mills. We're going to be doing picking up a popcorn fundraiser here in the next couple of weeks. Those are going to be coming out. So if you see somebody, just know it's made right here in Weather Texas in Sweet Amelia. So check out that. If you are leaving a fundraiser, please holler and give me a call. I'd love to get you set up. In whatever color they need. Yes, and whatever color and whatever school that you want to do, of course, because it's a school, yes. or like we said before, you can do any color you want. Yes. And um, I think we'd love to help you out. With the so thank you. It's been great. Thanks, Chris. Thank you. Thanks for coming out and letting us talk.